How's it going everybody? Aka, and I'm back here with the result of what's in the bag from Perth Mint. And guess what guys? There isn't a winner. None of you guessed it. And seeing that that competition is closed, I've deleted all your comments on your selections. Because, out of goodness of my own heart, I'm going to give you another six hours. So it's 4 p.m. Friday afternoon here in Perth, Western Australia. That's 12 hours ahead of the main time in USA. So it's 4 a.m. general in the United States. Give or take a couple of hours for different states. So I'm going to keep it open for another six hours. Hence, six coins. All right. um, so therefore, I'll be shutting this down. Perth time, six hours from now, so 10 or 11 p.m., all right, I'm going to just close it, and that's it, and uh, I'm asking you guys, all the content creators, to have another go at it. Uh, I do realise that it is one in 15 chances, according to Google, it's one in 15 chances, I'm not sure if that's correct or not, I've tried doing the calculations but I think it's more than that <laughs> okay uh, considering so I thought that somebody would have got it honestly I really did uh, considering to win lotto is one in 275,000 chances okay so this one here is, should have been a little bit easier but hey it is a bit of a doozy especially when you're going is it a skippy and a wombat is it a super pit and a wombat is it a super pit and a skippy or is it a super pit and a quokka or is it a kookaburra and a super pit is it a kookaburra and a wombat is it a kookaburra and a skippy is it a quokka and a skippy is it a quokka and a kookaburra is it a wombat and a super pit is it a wombat and a koala is it yeah so i think it's a bit more than 15 so i think that Google has been bullshitting. So I think it's like 150 chances, to be honest. Um, if the, if you are wondering, I haven't opened that. And if you think that I would change it or anything, for one, I'm not like that at all. Besides, here is the receipt from the Perth Mint. And there's the date. 19th being Thursday when I went to the Perth Mint to go and get some Brumbies and they didn't have it. So I decided to get two other coins. Then I decided, I thought, I'll play a little game. We'll see whoever guesses what two are in there. They can, they win it. And they send me their address. If I've got, if I've got their address already, well, I'll just send it out to you. Not a problem at all. Congratulations. But nobody won it. So this here is the actual proof of purchase. All right. Now, to pick on you guys a little bit. All right. Aztec, there's no fucking ACDC coin here, mate, okay? <laughs> there's none there, mate, all right? Same with Mississippi Metals. There, there's no, no swan. Actually, I haven't even got the swan coin. I've always missed out on them because they sell like bloody damn hotcakes. Um, what else? Oh, the code word was Skippy Land, and I would have accepted Perth Mint. Now, I picked on the Aztec and I picked on Mississippi Metals. Don't, just take it on the chin, guys. You've got to watch and read the instructions. Now, talking about instructions, guys, they were very simple. There's one thing I've learned out of this, and I already know from at work, people don't follow fucking instructions. Even I go, oh, there's the instruction sheet. Oh, we don't need that. All right, but yes... We actually do, because after just doing 30 odd hours of BHP inductions, mate, you have to follow instructions, okay? Or else you're doing it again on the induction. And if you get it wrong, you're doing it again. And I'm talking, watch the whole video again for 20 minutes and then do the test. No, you got one wrong. Do it, watch it again, follow the instructions, start taking photos is what I started doing, all right? So here's the revised instructions. So actually the rules of the game is the same, except for the fact is I've eliminated a code word and it's down to six hours. All right, so no code word 
required once again the first person who guesses it correct if there's a couple it will be the first one that appears on the hours on the comment okay so um, no need to I'll just put that up there as proof of rules you can all pause and read of that all right so let's have another go out of today and let's have a guess it's what is in the bag from the Perth Mint. Come on, guys. You just can do it. Have another go. Oh, by the way, I deleted all the comments on the other one. So you, we're not going to be able to go through and look at what other people picked. Okay? All right. Have another go, guys. Come on. There's only two ounces in here. you got to guess. You've got to guess. Okay? There's your selection. It's either two of any one of those. Right? I think it's a 1 in 150 chances because I've been trying to play the the um, how many chances are there. So, come on. Have another go. Closing at 10 o'clock p.m. My time. 